Hello, welcome back to Mel Rising Revengeance. I'll just cut the bullshit, we're just getting straight to the game. B Mel, Blade Wolf's on hard. Woo, we get to play as the doggy. Blade Wolf Chaos, this ought to be great. What? It, well, it, it, you will see them through down to the letter. Not or that else. Blade Wolf Chaos, just <laughs> it's Blade Wolf. Metal Wolf you know Chaos, and I want my President I Michael you? Wilson. I trust that will serve as adequate well, you're motivation. not playing as Blade Wolf and his awesome so, form. You're playing as him and his LT84, whatever the hell the serial number is. The objective on your, your original model? Yeah. So how does he <laughs> control? He's very similar to Raiden. But his gameplay is stealth focused. So you know this is gonna be well after the last The target star is parked in front of the hotel. Head there now. Yeah. Kill your enemies in a single Why would you have to be stealth focused? You're a freaking metal giant wolf thing. You're not unstoppable. You remember those wolves I took out in droves? Yeah, they're still just as easy to kill. Blade Wolf is not unstoppable, so. Uh, it just, I don't know, it seems kind of weird that it's more stealth focused. Especially after the action focused Jet Dream Sam. Right? Especially, I don't think stealth when I look at giant, the giant saw wielding metal wolf guy. <laughs> and maybe if they had, like, a predator like in Vizzo mode that would have been interesting yeah give him like stealth camo and then try to uh, give him some more flexibility with stealth because you're just kind of just walking around in the open and nobody just seems to notice you're around I don't know it's the target the president that what's his name him. you know he's a good guy because he's a president actually <laughs> Wasn't his name Prime Minister, Prime Minister? Hello, uh, 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 President Important Person. Well, anyway. Uh, that was actually a VR mission. Dude. Well, what did you think of the exercise? Mission accomplished. The target was neutralized. <laughs> that giant intellect and this is all you have to say? I obey the orders I am given. I was not ordered to gather data on the merits of the mission. <laughs> Perhaps you are more like a dog than I thought. Your kill count, though, it is disappointing. Perhaps some So what enemies didn't you kill, man? Man's killer instinct. <laughs> I killed well, all four enemies, and we might use to all three enemies, and the target. <laughs> Clearly, you didn't. Sorry, I played a stealth mission like a stealth mission. Is it bad that I feel bad for those little hand droids? You remember Miss Straw for the main game? Because <laughs> she certainly had a lot to do in the main game. I only killed her the first chapter. She had what? Um. A whole part to herself. Wow. Yeah, that was great. You that they aren't people at all. That they are less than human. That they are like animals. Fiends. Jeez, lady, why don't you just uh, say it out loud? Quit beating around the bush. It's kind of, you know, not that interesting. I possess neither man's killer instinct nor his moral urge to resist it. None of your methods would be effective. <sighs> Are you saying I cannot teach you any new tricks? <laughs> Very well. Continue your training. You know what those little four guys reminds me of? Chair formation? No, I was gonna say they remind me of pranks. Well, that's basically what huh. they are in this game. They're there to be the targets. Yeah. Well, anyway. Not there, oh, dude! <laughs> like I said, he plays very similarly to uh, Ryan in terms of quick attacks versus strong attacks, so I kind of skipped this tutorial. The more the merrier, no? Uh, hey, it's Filler Villain! Different AI, but it's still just an LQ84. Uh... Body bag number zero zero eight two. Oh, it speaks. I'm Kansan, aka the Desert Storm. You will be 
it. Do I sound impressive? I'm trying really hard to sound impressive. Yeah. I'm the final boss of this chapter. America. America. My hometown is Detroit. You should go there. Visit sometime. I have. It's not bad. As long as you don't know it's not as bad as it sounds. By that I mean stay the hell away from the giant. Well, just stay away from Detroit, period. Well, it's kind of hard to when I have a cousin who lives there. All I can say is go to Bomberitos. They got great subs. Authentic Italian bakery. I have not been to a good bakery in a long Worth time. Worth Worth generation. Okay. Right, guys, this location. Said bakery. Is this another VR? This simulation, we have yes. Recreated the mission area no, it's not. VR. Obviously, the real world has to load in. On your map. Oh, he oh okay. Just check. His vision is loading in. Well, anyway, this is our only new weapon for this chapter: heat knives. You can carry ten of them, and they're just a nice one-shot weapon. A nice way to take out an enemy silently from a distance, kind of? Well, you have to be careful, because an enemy might pick up on you throwing him, but... Especially if you miss. But it's a nice little rage alternative in combat. It's worth having. I do like his animations, though. Yeah, but apparently you can't make jumps like that. Yeah. There you go. And don't ask me where he gets all these heat knives from, because every time you do a jump stealth kill, he throws three knives every time. And they aren't taken out of your inventory. Fun. Magical knives. Okay. As you see, we have a target for this mission. He's got a key card that'll get us into the area we have to get to. Key card. Is it a red key card? Well, we'll find out once I kill the guy. No, right I think it's now. the skull key card. Kinetic card. You guys are wrong, it's a white one. Well, shit. Hey, <laughs> you progress further. Turns out you needed the blue key card. Fuck! I could see it now, Blade Wolf is gonna hack an ATM. <laughs> Why would he do that? He's got no concept of money and no god gorilla man. Well sure, he he, he, need, he needs money so that he can repair himself. This is all VR based, no, it's there's no it's... physical damage. It's practice. You, that's the whole purpose of this, is training, so he... Let us dream, practicing. damn it! You take our dreams and then you crumble them up and throw them in the trash. Yeah, it's like when somebody in this group says, hey, I have a new bad game. And then I come into chat. <laughs> hey, 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 yep, and you say, so what is okay, it? Okay, guys, Tell most cathartic games. moment ever. <laughs> it's dead. Oh, uh, I bet that felt good when you killed that guy. I hate these gorillas. And I'm killing you just for good measure. Because <laughs> why the hell not? But your killer instinct still isn't strong enough. Yeah, low kill count. Give me more <laughs> enemies to kill you, say? Nonsense! Wait, low kill count? What are we fucking playing Call of Duty here? Come on. Well, well, you get... That that. The game counts both now your regular kills mission. and your stealth kills this time. So that was take that was uh, an S rank, so not bad. So far, two missions in, two S ranks. Fuck these things. There's one thing I love about Play Wolf is that you can stealth kill everything you see. Then it seems like his speed is a little bit higher. 
I'm just happy I can stealth kill the biggest bastards of my playthrough. Like this asshole. I don't think I forgot about you. Oh no, not the gecko. That's not a gecko. That's a raptor. Oh. Geckos were easy by comparison. Well, fine. I mean, I, I can understand why you enjoy that, especially how much some of the bigger, tougher guys can give you the hardest time in the main story. So, yeah. And yet, I still have yet to pick up a single health pack. Or take a single hit. Oh, hey, look, hey, it's Mr. Hammer's turn. Huh? What was that tail? They have electrolytes. It's what plants crave. And stab, and chance off. Actually, you haven't, I haven't seen you use the chainsaw ever. It's like, why is that there? <laughs> oh, be caught. <laughs> Not that it matters, because that was the last enemy. Goddamn! <laughs> No, no, you gotta reset, Matt. I, we can't accept this. So it's the last enemy. I see an enemy over there. Yeah, but he's also like two rooms away. You know, if this was a real Metal Gear Solid stealth for like game, the every enemy would be on this floor would be immediately alerted to your presence. David Hayter would not be pleased. Well, it's still an S rank, even though I got caught once. Didn't feel like an S rank. Not bad. I will give you I got caught once and immediately neutralized the target. I don't call that much of a failure. Hurry to the objective. Shut up, boobs, McGee. Nobody asked you. Anyway, there was an optional encounter back there I skipped. Don't really know what it was, don't really care. It was optional. Oh dear god, block puzzles, no! <laughs> Is it obvious where- <laughs> oh god, double gorilla. The gorillas have been doubled. Dear god, what- When the hell did this become Super Mario Sunshine? Honestly, I'm expecting to hear the Mario theme a cappella. Don't sing any more of them, we'll get in trouble. <laughs> no, we won't. <laughs> uh, I got caught by somebody. With a rocket launcher. Rocket Mook! Rocket Mook! Here's the thing, that one rocket took off half my health. Wow, what are you made out of? Super Machine? Oh, now you're using the chainsaw on your back. The uh, hard mode, these guys do a lot of damage to you, so you can't get caught, really. You died. Right, take two. I don't know. I don't know what to think of platforming in this game. I mean, your jump is pretty strict from what I can tell. As the blade wolf stalks its prey, it delivers the uh, uh, the knives into its victim as it rips out its spinal cord. Apparently, one was not enough for him to save Tunger. The mooks with the rocket launcher see their fallen allies, and but they can do nothing. No, they don't even see their fallen allies. Unfortunately, oh, now I've got the problem of how do I get back up without getting caught. Yes, how do you do the stalker? 
simple. You remember these? He uses porn. Successfully? Hey, look at this! Yep. Uh, sexy, sexy. Hey, what the? What the? I don't hey, even know what I hit. Did it like fall through the floor? I don't know what happened to it. You, you well, threw it this over one. the platform. No! I was distracted by the jiggling. <laughs> It was like... <laughs> uh, I always wanted to make a dead or alive comment. Oh, don't worry. I've got plenty more photos to use by the end. Alright, here we go. Time for platforming. <laughs> Sorry, Worm. I tried to be the White Knight and I failed. Clearly, I am not you. Well, anyway, I forgot something very important. There's Collectibles? Thing. Yes, there's a thing. And what's in the thing? I don't know, it's a thing, it's a thing, it's a thing. Think, think, think. What did I find? Health upgrade. Yay, oh. health upgrade! Energy upgrade. Ah. So I have more played mode that I'm never gonna use. Well, well, the only reason yeah. why you would use blade mode anyway is if you were uh, in like melee combat, but you're using stealth, which doesn't bother with blade mode as much. Yeah, I do it for the Zendatsu at the end. Oh, I mean to ask, what does Zendatsu even mean? I think we went through this. It's to steal or acquire. I don't remember us having it during commentary though, that's... Yeah, we had it after commentary during... Some Metal Gear Rising. Which, yeah. by the way, check it out on the channel if you have not. Mines, I'm assuming? Yep. Hit one, our explosions will chain to each other, so... Good you use for your knives. You know what as hell? If all the yellow blo uh, boxes were, uh... uh blocks were actually cardboard boxes. I think that would be kind of, like, humorous. <sighs> yeah, why would the entire of a military train program even bother with them being made look like cardboard? Because... reasons. Oh, hello, Mr. Hammer. Here's payback for that rooftop. He is the hammer. He was the hammer. Oh god, and there's more of those big gorillas down there. But that one's dead. Now here's the fight thing. I've never not gotten caught killing one of them. The moment you kill one, the other's suddenly aware. So there's a little bit of actual combat with Playbook. He seems like a combo juggler. Well, the problem is getting him up in the air. I'm yeah. juggling. This couldn't possibly have anything to do with platinum games. Oh, we're gonna be seeing uh, plenty of that when I eventually do Bayonetta for the channel. Well, hurry up and do it then. And it best be good. Because yeah, you yeah. have to. Because Chaos has to follow you with Bayo 2. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, but then I I've been playing this on hard mode, so I expect hard mode. That's what happens when I when I get thrown I'm on a... front street with games. I will throw other people under the bus. <laughs> I'll need a lot. I'm gonna need a lot of practice because Bayon uh, Bayonetta 2 is pretty difficult. Uh, or Bayonetta is be pretty difficult. And I would want to at least not uh, to get a, uh, silver or gold on every level. What you don't want to go for perfect platinums? Fuck no. Your platinum. Your Tomorrow we commence the operation. Have yourself fully pure platinum. I can get a few pure platinums on select missions, but throughout the entire game, ah. 